In mixed martial arts news, Brogan Walker will be stepping into the UFC cage in the finale of The Ultimate Fighter 30 to face Juliana Miller. So what I've been preparing for is a real aggressive opponent. Um, my opponent, Juliana Miller, likes to fight. Uh, she's a pressure fighter, so she likes to just move forward, um, throw punches. She's just a lot of pressure. Um, her strong suit is jujitsu, so she pairs that pressure with um, like smothering. She'll try and grab you, try and drag you down, that kind of thing. Uh, wrestling's not too strong, so we're kind of um, we're kind of comfortable with the game plan that we we've come up with um, to address the pressure. We're working a lot of timing and catching them coming in, and to um, address the takedowns and the possible, you know, jujitsu exchanges. I've been working wrestling, scrambles, all kinds of good stuff to just kind of stay on top and, and work the positional hierarchy. You had the opportunity years ago to fight your way into the UFC, but the timing was off. Coming full circle and um, getting this opportunity, um, how does that feel knowing that you made the right decision uh, several years later to put yourself in, in a position where you are now? Um, again, I got to come back to gratitude because I'm just thankful that I had the right people around me, uh, to tell me to stop and look at the opportunities that I have. And, um, you know, sometimes opportunities like that, they look so good that, um, there's a lot of other things that don't get considered. And I, I have a lot of people around me that love me and care about me enough to, really like think about it and think about what my chances are, um, what my career is going to be like in the long run. And I'm just so grateful that everything has played out the way that it has. Um, like I was saying earlier, I feel like one of my strong suits both in the house and now uh, as a competitor in the UFC is my experience and my maturity. Um, my fight IQ is through the roof. Like I'm, I'm a teacher, but I'm, I'm such a student. I'm always studying film, always working on some, you know, new things and new tactics, new everything. How important is that for you to kind of making sure that you did put everything together so when you do get the opportunity to showcase everything, um, you are going to be able to, you know, handle yourself in that cage? Yeah, um, that's a good question. Thank you. I always feel good walking into a fight because of that preparation. I don't cut corners on purpose because when I do, it always sticks in the back of my mind. So if I had done any less training than I did or any less of anything that needed to get done for my fight camp, if I had cut corners on my diet or my strength training or anything, um, it would be in the back of my mind moving into that fight and that affects you. So I've, got a good handle on making sure that not just all my eggs are, you know, all my ducks are in a row, but also that like my head is straight and I'm not stressing about things that um, are out of my control. I just, it's become such a well-oiled machine that I, it's like everything just falls into place. My teammates know what to do, my coaches know what to do, Lloyd knows what to do. He doesn't let me forget anything and um, yeah. It's, it's a science. There's a lot of science and math going on here. 